The first thing I tasted was rust. Bitter, metallic, clinging to my tongue like a shroud. My eyes fluttered open to a sky the color of bruised plums, choked by a perpetual twilight. Razor wire, as thick as python, snaked across the barren landscape. It took the bit of old machine under the sickly light. A wind, cold and reeking of decay, whipped around me, carrying whispers that scraped against my sanity like claws on bone. Memories flickered and fragmented and distorted a swirling vortex of color. A name I couldn't grasp. A chilling laughter that echoed in the hollow chambers of my body. I sat up the moon, sending a chill of pain through my body. My hands were bound with chains as thick as tree trunks, cold metal biting into my flesh. Where was I? When it happened, panic clawed at my throat. A monstrous thing of hungry to be unleashed. But even fear fell muted, dulled by a pervasive sense of wrongness, like waking inside a nightmare that refused to end. A low growl reverberated through the air, sending shivers down my spine. Something shifted in the shadows beyond the razor wire. Its shape indistinct, but undeniably malevolent. The whispers intensified, morphing into words I couldn't decipher, yet understood with chilling clarity. Welcome to Razor Wire. Your nightmares are just beginning. My gaze darted around the desolate landscape, a sense of impending doom pressed down on me, suffocating inescapable. I was trapped, a prisoner, in this waking nightmare, and the only escape was through the labyrinthine corridors of my own fractured mind. But would I survive the journey? Would I even recognize myself at the end?